Adam Furstein, there's a lot happening over at Gilead Sciences. Why don't you tell me what's going on? Yeah, Greg, uh, you know, Gilead is finishing work on three different clinical trials of its hepatitis C pill, um, Savospavir. Uh, these trials are all designed to show that Savospavir, and, and I can't stand saying that word, um, <laughs> can shorten treatment for hepatitis C or, or remove the need for weekly shots of interferon. Well, it's definitely a tough word to say, but you're not going to describe all three of these hep C trials for us here, right? No, I'm definitely not going to do that. You know, I can barely keep them straight in my own head. Um, you know, suffice to say, Gilead is um, Gilead's going to be announcing these results later this month, perhaps into March. Um, you know, it's safe to say that investors right now expect the data to be positive, uh, which will allow Gilead to seek FDA approval in the middle of the year. The huge move in Gilead stock in the last year, we'd say, uh, would you say that that's due to the multi-billion dollar potential from its hep C drugs? Yeah, that's right, Greg. You know, these trials... Uh, you know, these trials and the initial approval in, uh, are expected kind of in early 2014. And, you know, and they're the appetizer for the main course, which is going to come later, and that's the potential for a once-daily single-pill therapy to treat and cure hepatitis C. You know, that is the big prize, and depending on how the Cephosphavir study results go, um, Gilead could be the first to claim it. Thanks, Adam.